What's going on everybody and welcome back to another Washi Bros Outdoors YouTube video. Uh, as you all know, if you follow us on Instagram, we are going down to Savannah, Georgia to meet up with Scotty. Uh, it's about a five hour and 50 minute drive from Raleigh to Savannah. We're about an hour and 15 into the trip and we hope to get on some trout, some redfish, maybe some flounder. We'll keep you guys updated. Stay tuned. Well, you all, we have made it to South Carolina, and you know what that means. We gotta stop and we're gonna gas up the truck and the boat and then keep on trekking. I think we got about another two and a half hours, and then we'll be in Savannah. I'm excited. Hopefully, next time y'all see me, we'll be out on the water. Peace. What's going on everybody? We have put the boat in the water and we have made it to our first fishing spot. So we're gonna get the cameras out, get the rods out. And we're actually seeing some porpoises right now, back in this creek. <laughs> That's how you call it. <laughs> so we got in, we're fishing the low tide this morning and the tide's gonna be coming in throughout the day. So then we'll be able to fish high tide around two, I think it is. Throwing a top water, um, super spook. Grayson's throwing a jig with a paddle tail, and Scotty's throwing a jig with a shrimp. Going along, pepper in the bank. First bait change this morning. That's what I'll be throwing today. Hoochie Coochie. Big paddle tail. Throw a little Procure on it. Get a nice scent in the water. Obviously, hold on, let me get a video. Let's keep her trout. So we've already beat the skunk. Grayson hooked up on our first trout, fishing a silver mullet on a jig head. Throw him in the cooler. Get perfect. Drift. Keep and us we're drifting. And we're drifting.
low tide. Are we still low tide? Yep. Until it's all the way. Keeper. It's only four now. It's only gonna be coming back up, right? Yeah. Point. Day two. What's going on everybody and welcome back to day two of fishing. Today we are at Bandy's Bait and Tackle. And yesterday we got pretty beat up because of the wind. Only caught one 15 inch trout. Hopefully we can get on some fish with some live bait. We're fishing low tide this morning. Uh, without further ado, let's get into the video. Up under the dock. Are you in the middle? Yeah. Trout. Water skin. Oh. Choked it. Same old, same old. Washer goes trout number 200 on this boat. Nice cast, jeez. Joe, you wanna wear a gut one?
We are on our way home from Savannah. Logan is driving. We are about, what, three hours left? Three hours left, 624. Three hours left. We had a pretty good weekend seeing Scotty. Although the fishing wasn't the best, um, we think the uh, fishing was really tough because they had so much rain as we did in North Carolina. And all the, the water was super murky and seemed brackish, so we were thinking the fish uh, were kind of acting funky. We had talked to two other fishermen that were on the uh, on the boat ramp with us, and they were saying that the fishing was terrible for them too. And, and they caught a catfish. They, they, they were like, yeah, man, we caught a catfish. Like, we don't know what's going on. So, what? not the best fishing, but sometimes you can't catch them all, and that's how life goes. So we're gonna roll with the punches and hopefully be able to get on some fish in the future. We truly tried everything to catch these fish. We threw our fly rod, we threw top, we, or walk, we walked the dog, we threw popping corks, we threw flukes, we threw uh, split tails, we threw live bait mud meadows, we threw live shrimp, we threw everything in our arsenal. I'm, I mean, we went back into creeks, we fished the main channels, man, it was so tough to catch fish this weekend. Um, but we did end up catching two trout. We hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. Until next time, Washi Bros, we're out.